everyone, it's me, the Otaku Fangirl, here to review episode 8 of Netju Netuju no Susume, or Recovery of the Nimino Junkie, whatever you want to call it. So with this episode, he finally said it! Ah, oh, that was great, and they have the, oh, there's all these cute moments, and I can't contain... Ah, okay, so, with this episode, we get backstory a little bit on, um, Sakadai and his whole, you know, when he was Hearth in the other game, that it's like Nantar SG, something like that, and how he, uh, would always talk to this one character named Yuki, and, you know, he's like, oh, it can't be the same person, Morioko, or whatever her name is, can't be, you know, and I'm just like, it is, coincidence like this can't happen, just, just shut up, and just, mm. but anyway, so yeah, yeah, there was that, but, um, so when he got into the game as his, as his hearth character, you know, she doesn't notice at all, but she's like, like, how do I pronounce his name? I just don't know. And, um, it is, like, you know, a big difference, like, in appearance, because in the other game, they kind of look like children, and in this game, they look more like adults, so it's just that, but, uh, anyway, so, you know, she doesn't notice at all until later, uh, he tells her how to pronounce his name, and, and then she has her flashbacks and everything, and her, you know, all that stuff, and we don't get to see exactly why she was fired from her job, so there was that, but I was like, dang, okay, well, let's keep this lighthearted, though, I'm like, yeah, let's not go into her probably that was probably real depressing for her because she never logged into the game after that you know that's what uh Sakurai said that he never saw her after that so it's just like yeah it's probably real depressing and i don't want to hear it um <laughs> so anyway they uh spend some time in game with their new characters uh molly and uh hearth and it's just just a nice little just Ah, greatness, but, um, <laughs> so, with the real-life selves, though, um, also with Sakurai, he lost his parents, uh, his adoptive parents, he's adopted, um, and that's when he started playing MMOs and all that, but, uh, anyway, so with the real-life versions of themselves, um, <laughs> It's like, they go around in circles until he finally, at the very end of the episode, says, Oh, by the way, I'm Lily. And I'm just like, you could have said that, like, maybe 15 minutes ago in the actual episode. But that's fine. Um, I'm just like, they keep going around in circles. I just want him to reveal it. He just needs to say it, and then we'll be good. But, <laughs> so, when they uh, meet up in real life, because he was walking home and she was walking wherever, um, they meet up, and that's when the whole conversation goes down of like, you know, she's like, oh, you know, I play a guy online, and there's this girl named Lily, you remind me a lot of her, and, <laughs> and I'm just like, dude, say it, like, she just revealed that she plays a guy online, like, he was super worried that, you know, if he reveals he's Lily, she'll think weirdly of him. Also, they had this nice conversation on the phone earlier, before I get to the whole end scene, um, on the phone where, like, <laughs> Like, she was like, oh, you know, I felt pathetic and everything and stuff, and he called her not pathetic, and I'm just like, you're so cute. I love it. I love it. Oh, oh my gosh. But they, let's like, just start dating or something, please. Like, go on a date. I don't know. Do something with your lives, people. Just do. I just need y'all to. Oh, my gosh, because they're just so cute together. But anyway, with the end scene, though. But finally, he reveals he's Lily, and I'm just like, you know, she's laying out the grounds for it. You know, it's like, she's like, oh, there's this character, Lily. Oh, I play a guy online. Oh, this, this, and this. And then he's just like, oh, okay, I'm Lily. And I'm just like, Finally, she's not gonna think, you know, lowly of him at all, I feel like. She's like, oh, you know, she's probably gonna be surprised, but she's also gonna be like, oh, oh wow, like, really? And she's gonna probably be happy, you know, because they've spent so much time together in the game. Because she played a guy online, and he played a girl online, so it's not that big of a deal. It's not that big of a problem, you know? It's like, he made it up to be this huge, big problem, but it wasn't, and I'm just, at least I hope it won't be, because I don't, I don't think Mori is going to be that kind of person, like, ew, gross, you like girl, I ain't disgusting, you know, it's like, no, she's going to be accepting of it, because she did the same thing, just playing a guy, so, yeah, this episode was really good, it was really cute, and I can't wait for the next one, I guess I'm like, yay, and it looks like someone was in the shower in the next episode, I'm like, what's that about? So, anyway, what'd you guys think of this episode? What do you think's gonna happen next? And I'll see you guys, whatever I review next. Bye!